Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to learn how to do a burpee without having knee pain or lower back pain. Now today's burpee will be a low impact version. Most people don't do burpees because they think that their knees cannot take it, their lower back cannot take it. So any workout can be corrective if done correctly and in proper technique. So today we're going to do 20 burpees as a form of strength and resistance training while correcting our posture and strengthening our core, our shoulders and our whole body. If you're ready, let's go. I'm going to have you stand hip width apart. I'm going to face this way, hip width apart. Your second and your third toes will be pointing straight at 12 o'clock. So feet knees and hips are in the same line from here you will put your hands down bend your knees generously if you need to and step one leg to the back step one leg to the back into a nice plank position make sure that your shoulders are over your wrist from here step one foot up near to the chest the other foot up near to the chest and stand and raise your hand so that is one rep now from the front wheel i want to show you that as you step in your challenge is not to let your knees cave inwards all right so if i'm facing you here so that you can see my knees so i'm gonna place my hands down i'm gonna step out okay and when i step in before I come up, I want to make sure that my feet are pointing straight and my knees are not caving inwards. That is how you correct your alignment, correct your feet from turning out while doing a modified burpee. Alright, so this is how it goes. Hands down, step out, step in, pointing straight and stand. All right, guys, let's do this. We're going to do 20 each time, leading with a different leg. All right. Standing hip width apart, hands down, step. Step. That's one. Step. Step. That's two. Step. Step. That's three. Remember to always step with your feet pointing to 12 o'clock. Four. Five. Squeeze your glutes. Six. Seven. Eight. Shoulders over your wrist. Nine. Ten. All right, guys, for the next ten, I want to give you a little bit of a challenge. You are going to bend your elbows a little bit into a mini push up. So when you bend your elbows, make sure that your elbows are pointing towards the back and are not flaring out. All right, 10 more. One, mini push up. Two, step out, mini push up. Three, mini push up. You can do a full push up if you want to. Four, five. Make sure that even as you go down, your lower back is not sagging. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one guys, good form, mini push up, 
and we're done. Alright guys, good job. Try to do this daily to see an improvement in strength and to set a positive tone for the day.